Hi, I'm Coach Joe with Copilot. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to use the rower. So first thing that you wanna do is make sure you're sitting on the seat, slide it all the way to the front. To adjust the foot plates, you're gonna pull them out and adjust them down or up depending on how big your foot is. The more holes that are showing at the top is better for smaller feet. The less holes at the top is better for larger feet. In order to know that you've gotten it adjusted properly, when you slide your feet into those straps and pull them nice and tight, those straps should fall right around the widest part of your shoe. From here, you're gonna slide forward, grab the handle with both hands, palms facing down, thumbs wrapped underneath completely. Driving through your heels, you're gonna sit up nice and tall, driving back through your legs, lean back with your core and pull that handle in with your arms. Shoulders are relaxed at your sides, elbows are down, and that handle is coming right to your sternum. On the way in, you're gonna reach forward with your arms first, lean forward and then bring, bend your legs, bringing yourself back to your starting position. First step when you're rowing is to drive hard through your legs. Second step is lean back with your core. Third step, pull that handle into your sternum with your arms. When you're coming forward, it's the opposite order, arms, core, legs. One, two, three. One, two, three. Making sure that your legs are fully extended before you start to lean and you are leaning before pulling with those arms. The rower is primarily a leg driven exercise. So you wanna make sure that you are pushing hard off of your foot plates, utilizing your lower body, lean with your core and pull with your arms. All right, so some common mistakes with the rower is pulling with the arms too soon and getting crunchy at the top of the row. So we wanna make sure that instead of pulling too soon, we wanna make sure that we're driving with our legs. That pull is the final step in the row. Another common mistake is going over the knees on the way forward. Bending the knees a little bit too soon instead of letting that handle come forward and pass the knees before bending. Another big mistake is forgetting to lean back with your core and staying upright the whole time. So your core plays a really big role in keeping yourself braced and getting the full range of motion with every single stroke. Once you're done, you'll rack the handle, unstrap your feet and pop your feet out. You can find a rower in almost every gym. Try it out next time and ask your coach to program it for you. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to subscribe.